The Morning Office for January 23rd. Let us make a vow to the Lord and keep it. Let all around him bring gifts to him who is worthy to be feared. Let my cry come before you, O Lord. Give me understanding according to your word. Let my supplication come before you. Deliver me according to your promised word. I will offer you a free will sacrifice and praise your name, O Lord, for it is good. How sweet are your words to my taste. They are sweeter than honey to my mouth. The morning reading is taken from Matthew's Gospel, chapter 5, verses 33 through 37. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Jesus taught us, saying, Again you have heard how it was said to our ancestors, You must not break your oath, but you must fulfill your oaths to the Lord. But I say this to you, do not swear at all, either by heaven, since it is God's throne, or by earth, since that is his footstool, or by Jerusalem, since that is the city of the great king. Do not swear by your own head, either, since you cannot turn a single hair white or black. All you need to say is yes, if you mean yes, and no, if you mean no. Anything more than this comes from the evil one. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. How sweet are your words to my taste. They are sweeter than honey to my mouth. The morning psalm is read from Psalms chapter 106, verses 1 through 5. Hallelujah. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. For his mercy endures forever. Who can declare the mighty acts of the Lord or show forth all his praise? Happy are those who act with justice and always do what is right. Remember me, O Lord, with the favor that you have for your people, and visit me with your saving help, that I may see the prosperity of your elect and be glad with the gladness of your people, that I may glory with your inheritance. How sweet are your words to my taste. They are sweeter than honey to my mouth. O God, come to my assistance. O Lord, make haste to help me. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us today our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory for ever and ever. Amen. Give us grace, O Lord, to answer readily the call of our Savior Jesus Christ, and proclaim to all people the good news of his salvation, that we and the whole world may perceive the glory of his marvelous works, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, for ever and ever. Amen. Lord God, Almighty and Everlasting Father, you have brought me in safety to this new day. Preserve me with your mighty power, that I may not fall into sin, nor be overcome by adversity. And in all I do, direct me to the fulfilling of your purpose, through Jesus Christ my Lord. Amen.